Welcome back to Artex. Today we're going to review the high power car charger from Moki. So I ordered this from Amazon. This is a nice product, I'm guessing, for Moki because I got their headphones the last time. So this is a two socket, dual socket rather, 4.8 amp uh, charger. So it's got two outputs of 2.4 amps each. So they should give some good uh, power output to your phones and uh, charge them pretty quickly. They don't have quick charge enabled in this one, but uh, the amperes are quite high for your phone to actually charge pretty fast. Uh, the packaging is typical Oki, uh, eco-friendly, not a lot of color used, just plain cardboard. It's so small, the box is so small. When you open the box, you straight away find a nice instruction manual, which they always give with all their products. And uh, you can see that it's mentioned that it's got uh, 24 wa watts of output uh, from both the plugs and it's got the AI power technology, which can automatically recognize your device and supply charge based on that. Uh, it's also got a lot of safety features built in and uh, they've also given you some cautionary notes saying that it's not waterproof. And of course, it comes with a warranty and uh, for 24 months. Yep. Yeah. So uh, there's no cable thrown in, so you'll have to use one of your old USB charging cables. Wow, that's uh, the Oki charger. It's very really small, but not as small as the TechSense charger, which I reviewed a couple of weeks back. You can see the link above if you want to watch that video. Uh, the finish on this one is plastic and fiber, I guess, plastic or fiber, and it feels really solid. Those are the two ports. I, I still don't know whether these glow in the dark, the ports, uh, but the springs and you know, the, the terminals are really, really high quality. And uh, this feels like one of your, uh, one of the parts which come with your car by default because the material is the same as what you get in your dashboard. Nothing fancy on it outside and it just says Oki and it doesn't even say which port is what but it both supply the same power 2.4 amps each. Okay, so let's go ahead and take this to the car and right away I just kept my TechSense charger next to it and the TechSense is in fact much much smaller and it's indeed one of the smallest in the world. Um, so the Oki looks a little bigger when you keep them side by side. So let me go ahead and plug this in. Car's a little dirty, but yeah. So when I plug it in, there's no light. Unfortunately, this thing doesn't glow. So in the dark, you'll have to actually uh, find your way to put the USB cords in. So just to prove it, I switched off the lights and there's absolutely nothing which indicates it's actually working, not even a small LED. So that could be a bit of a problem there for some of y'all who don't like something which doesn't have an indication that it's actually working. Look at the TechSense charger for just to show you guys. Okay, that really actually glows and it could be really helpful while plugging in a USB cable in the dark, right? Well, to be honest, uh, both these are almost similarly priced. The uh, TechSense is slightly expensive, but they do throw in a nice uh, USB cable, USB, micro USB cable. But uh, I think uh, from a performance perspective, both are similarly uh, good and both are high quality devices. Uh, but if you ask me, I would definitely go for the TechSense considering the glow ring it's got on that. Uh, but nevertheless, I think the Oki has also got some good features. So that's my small review on the Oki car charger. Thank you for watching the video. Please do subscribe. Uh, give us a like or dislike uh, if you like the video or don't like it. See you on the next one. See ya.